I think what we've seen is a very strong bear market rally. So if you look at the world index, um, actually it's 22% up from the low, driven by a 24.5% increase in uh, in the U.S. So you know, compared with where we are relative to the peak in markets, um, we're down about 20% uh, across uh, across the board. So you're almost on that cusp of um, bear market and correction uh, territory. So, you know, I think we have passed the point of, 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 uh, of maximum panic, but I still feel, given the numbers we saw yesterday and the numbers we've yet to see in earnings, um, that we've yet to heat, uh, hit uh, peak pessimism. Uh, uh, and, I, and I think, you know, full credit to the authorities uh, for acting quickly and swiftly uh, and, you know, ameliorating this impact. But I certainly feel that this is a classic bear market rally. The market's very much coming to grips with the comments that this is going to be the worst recession we've had since the 1930s, which means market participants are not used to the extent of this crisis. Do you worry that the market is not gauging correctly the structural damage that companies will face at the end of this pandemic? Um... You know, I think the first thing to say, look, there's, there is 20% down. There's an awful lot of uh, bad news already in the price. Uh, I think what we will see as we roll out through the second quarter is worsening economic numbers. Those were pretty horrible numbers, but they were only for, uh, for March in the U.S. And we'll start to see the impact on corporate earnings and, uh, and the corporate uh, and the corporate sector. Uh, but again, the numbers we're looking at at the moment for earnings, of course, are for uh, the, first, uh, the first quarter. So, um, yeah, I, I, I think there's still um, some gloom to come. Hi, I'm Joanna Bersacci, and thank you for watching. You can check out more of our videos by clicking on the boxes on the screen. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more from CNBC International. Thank you for watching.